Hi, it's Lynn with SoftSquare. Today I'm going to go over subscription boxes and my personal experience and opinion on the different boxes and packages that I subscribe to. There's quite a few. We're going to go over fabric, thread, um, quilt boxes, and sewing boxes. I'm standing here with a bunch of subscription boxes which are monthly subscription boxes for quilters and sewers mostly geared towards the quilter so I'm going to show you what's in the boxes I'm also going to talk about how to get a box and the link to get there I'm going to talk about what their prices are and what's in each individual box so this is going to give you a thorough comparison and opinion with from my point of view and I am going to uh, probably put something at the end of this that will give you like a quick reference sheet for all of this information. We are going to review all of these subscription kits, which are ones that I personally have received. There are others that I won't be covering because I don't know enough about them. I also have a little bit that I can share about some subscriptions that I've had within the last year that are not included in my current subscriptions. We're, they're not represented here at the box. But we're going to cover the Sew It box, Pre-Cuts Quilt Shop, Back Quarter Shop, Pastry Shop, Sewers Club, The Ginger Quilter, This is Reb's Fab Stash, and Open Gate. And this bag right here is Creative Notions. Okay, we're also going to cover um, Block of the Months and subscriptions for just fabric or thread. And so I've got two Annie's Kit Clubs, one for a Christmas quilt, one for just a sampler quilt. We also have a um, mystery quilt going on and that's a block of the month through Cotton Cuts. This right here is a monthly subscription for Fat Quarters through Annie's Kit Club. And this right here is Pineapple Fabrics. They offer um, a scrap bag called Dottie's Scrap Bags and they're nice big pieces of scraps and that's a subscription offering and then this little box right here is through cotton cuts and it is a thread subscription so thread only let's talk about them there we go open gate quilt box she gives you a nice little letter most of them do um, telling you about your projects project one this is a Halloween box uh, this is for the month of August we have old Salem black hat society wall hanging now look at this these are everything is individually packaged in here it's nice and clean to empty the box so and then she's got labels on them so here's the black hat society wall hanging and it has a picture of the item that you're making in this case it's a wall hanging and it has a panel in here and it has everything that you see there and the instructions it's 29 by 41 is the size and it's ready to go let's see um, heat and bond okay project two is a spooky towel which is this one and again these are projects which are fun because they kind of push you to do things that you might not have thought of or introduce you to something new and um, everything you need is there you don't have to go hunting for the stuff but this one comes with um, fabric for the applique oh by the way let's look at the picture here's your instructions here's a close-up picture of the towel and putting that on the bottom and how that goes on okay the What is included in this kit is heat and bond fusible webbing. Please note the instructions. 
um, a 20 by 28 black and white check towel. So this is actually a towel. There's black rickrack right here and a full color, color pattern, which is there. Okay, the next project is the notion of the month. And this month is a template kit. Very simple, very straightforward. This is great if you need a size or a shape that you don't have a ruler for or a template, like you want to have an outline of an apple. You can make one yourself and cut it out this plastic and have consistent size items. So this, it says Dritz sandpaper dots. So these are actually, there's four little dots on here. Maybe you can see better on the back. These dots are to give it some grip to, to put on the back of it. It's like the, the grip on the back of your ruler. So that's our notion for the month. We also get a new open gate pattern. The, it does not include the fabric for this. So we've got two projects in a fat pattern. This is uh, the fabric, the pattern. <laughs> you can't speak. And it comes with, it's called Roundabout, Fat Quarter Quilt Size 71 by 85. Kits are available online. So you can buy the, the fabric that's in there. Free shipping on this kit. Uh, they have Zoom classes and getting ready for Halloween. Decided to do send it early, blah, blah, blah. And thank you so much. So just kind of general stuff about the box. Oh, and I missed it. Thread, the black thread in here. So this month was uh, themed Halloween. pre-cuts quilt box. I'm not going to open this particular box, at least not right now, because it's also another Halloween themed box. And the most recent that came out came in a bag, but I wanted to show you that they normally come out in a box like this, but this is what you're going to find in it. It's the exact same stuff, just a different theme. So maybe we'll peek into that. So it starts out with your welcome. This is the classic box and it should tell me what month, with, with COVID, everything's off a little bit. So she's caught up through August. Then it breaks it down, what's in the box, and then a retail value. So the total box value is right here. So this particular one, and there's always pattern, thread, notions, pay, and the shipping is in there, and some other things. So there's usually at least six things. Fabric and the pattern are uh, always there. So here's the notion this month, these cute pins. And then here's another notion that is actually like a... Um, sewing kit, travel sewing bag. That's interesting. That's, I don't know what that's doing. It's got kind of sticky, <laughs> but that sticks together. Okay, so we have that and that. It also has the fabric that you need. In this case, it is uh, tulip pink fabric, deja vu fat quarter bundle, it has six fat quarters and two one yard cuts. And the boxing video will explain that, but these are each one yard cuts of that line. And it's partly because they're very large prints. And then you have all of these. And this is stuff that's also going to work with the pattern, which they've even incorporated in the picture so you get an idea of how that is supposed to look. And this is a 55 by 50. Sorry, 54 by 54 lap size quilt. It says it is beginner and intermediate. Um, and then it explains how and what to use to make that. And again, they've used the exact fabric on here. So, um, oh, and then there's one more thing. She's included five eighths of a yard of binding. It's meant to be used for the quilt binding. She does not always include that, but lately I've been seeing a little little more and that's cool. This is also Tula Pink and she uses the same colors. It's just not the exact line that are in here, but it doesn't matter on the binding. It's the same colors and that's really pretty. Okay, so that's what comes in the pre-cut box this month that came in a bag. 
and I'm going to open this other box just because it's here, and if we have more options, why not do it? This this is the month before. I don't have everything in here. It's my bad because I thought about this after I opened it. This I actually opened the jelly roll and then rolled it back up, so it does not look pretty. <laughs> but this is a line by Kimber Bell, and it is a full jelly roll. This is the pattern, and they've actually used the jelly roll on here. It's lap size 54 by 64. has a lot of white in it. Um, again, it breaks it down what you need, but this could be used in that. Oh, here we go. This box shows you your fabric, your pattern, and then it comes with um, thread, oh, which I didn't keep in the box. And then it has three extra pieces of fabric for um, just because you're going to need more. And those are included in here too. So it comes with orange, purple, and green from the same line. It also has a small um, five eighths of a yard print for binding. And that is what this is. And this is uh, the case where the, the line is not the same. This is actually a different line, but it coordinates, it's cute. This is a uh, Moda fabric. And that's, this one's Maywood, it doesn't matter, but they're going to work really well. Shipping's included in that. And then we also have, just for fun, a 5 8 one 5 8 cut glow-in-the-dark fabric by Castle Spooky. So this one was loaded with fabric. It didn't really have a notion to it. It just had lots of fabric. So typically there's a notion, but I'm not going to complain about getting fabric. Oh, and there's always a block of the month. I must have removed it from the kit that I just pulled out of the bag. It does have a block of the month in it. I just got excited and took the box apart and put it back together and missed that. <laughs> so, anyway, there we go with that. Pre-cut quilt box is one of my favorite boxes. Uh, you do get bigger pieces. I do think they're a little more on the expensive side. It's about 60 bucks a month um, to get these. And you just have to decide for yourself if it's something that you like. I personally like what I'm getting. I do think it's a little on the high side compared to some of the other options that I have. Stash box by Rebs Fab Stash. All these boxes come with tissue around them. Not many of them still have it, uh, as I go to show you, but this one I was able to salvage. But you open it up and there's your surprise, all kinds of fun things. So this kit, um, this is, does it say what month? It, oh, it does. This is September. Again, all of these have their own individual unboxing video for more detail, just showing you what comes in a kit and the price you pay and the value so you can have things to compare. So anyway, you get this nice card every month. It always comes with at least a block and they, it, so it's really good. It's not necessarily building anything, but it's really good skill builder. And it shows you a picture of the block. This one comes with a project, which is this case is a pillow. It also has, um, which is a big pillow by the way, a placemat and the, it has patterns and fabric that you need for all of these things. They always send something with their name on it. In this case, it was a lint roller with a little um, emergency sewing kit in it. And then you're going to get just a unique fat quarter and a recipe card. So this particular box came with popcorn rolls and it's for September. Here's my fat quarter, and here are my projects. So here's the patchwork leaf block, and here's, no, oh, you can't see it. There's all the fabric that you need for the projects. So it's not pre-cut, but they're fabric pieces big enough to get your pieces cut out of it. So that's what this is. Now, the one thing I like about this also is they tell you over here what the line is. So this says, fabric is from uh, the Adele in Autumn collection and now I know what the fabric is so if I want more I know what it was and can get to it. 
Okay, so this one is the Acorn Bench Pillow. This is a good size pillow. It, I think, is... Where did it go? Oh, there we go. Has its instructions. And this one will make approximately 14 by 28 with the three big acorns on it. It gives you all of your fabric that you need in there, including your backing. And this looks like it's a pillow closure, so it's no zipper. <laughs> nice and nice and easy. And they also use the same fabric line. I know that because it says right here. Um, uh, da, 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 da. <laughs> Where am I going? Uh, Bountiful Autumn Collection. Oh, it's not. It's never mind. I for some reason thought they were. I've lost my mind. <laughs> so we have two projects here right now so far. And the fat quarter, ah, two projects, fat quarter, our invoice, the recipe card, the um, card explaining what's in there. Here's our little swag. Uh, it's different every month. Like I said, this case, it was a lint roller, and this opens up and has a needle and thread and a little safety pin in there. And it's nice because it's really thin and portable and adorable. So that's what that was. And then we have one more project in here, and this is the pumpkin patch placemat pattern, and you get the full pattern. This one is actually um, from Annie's. These others, I believe, are theirs, but it comes with all the fabric that you need including the backing. It came with buttons to do this, and it even has a template to make the leaf, wherever that is. Let me think where I put it. I moved it, oh, there it is. So they make it easy, and they make it so you will not be scared to try new things. And that's what I like. They also give you um, a QR code that takes you to um, where you can get more ideas on these, as well as tell you how you can find them on Facebook, and they do videos, live videos and Facebook uh, events. But I think it says right here. Um, stay up to date by following us on social media and watching our emails. The sew it box. This box is not a quilting box, it's a sewing box. So she's going to send you everything you need for a sewing project, as well as the pattern and an online video for how to make it. And then I, I'm also doing those too. So all of these already have unboxing videos, so you can see more detailed of what they are. I'm just giving you a quick review for the sake of this comparison video of what comes in them. So you get a notion, get a little note from her. She always sends uh, this little fabric bundle, which are not related to the project. So you get two fat quarters, and these are the ones that are this month. It also has this little ribbon that you can cut up and use as um, a ribbon or a label on your projects. So you actually have two things that come out of that. And then you have your project that's down there in a the little box. And it, it comes with tissue paper that I don't have in here anymore, and it helps to get that out. <laughs> So this month we are making the roll-up cable organizer. There will be a video that will come out on that. I was waiting for this video before I started to make it. But it gives you everything you need for it. So you see you, it comes with pins and a sewing machine needle. It has a zipper, which looks, looks like it goes right there. You get a thread. The fabric is already cut. This feels like a flannel. So it is the exact size that you need. You don't have to worry about cutting this at all. And sometimes there's, um, yeah, th these just happen to be nice rectangles. And then it has elastic because that's what you're going to use to hold everything in. So um, 
watch for that. These are some of the projects I've made from the Sew Up box. This right here is a shoe bag. It zips on the bottom, but it has a handle right here and it holds a pair of shoes. So got to work with a uh, half circle, rounded corners and curves. Had a long zipper. Again, it's pre-cut. Everything you need is there to go in. Another one I've made is this, which is a sunglass holder. It's a good size wide pouch. It came with the metal closure, the hardware, and um, your fabric. It even has the inside, which in this case was fleece, but it, it she seriously gives you everything you need. And then here's another one that I made. It's kind of a big bowl. That's where I've been keeping my stuff in. It's deep. But that was a good experience too, working with these curved lines and it came with the faux leather straps and it has interfacing in it. And then you do have options to get things that are from past boxes. And I had about a set of six of these keychains. I only have four left, I've given some away. But they're pre-cut with interfacing, your hardware, everything you need, including instructions. And those are the types of things that you get in your box. I, I missed this. <laughs> okay, you're gonna also get this. This tells you your prep time, two minutes, which is basically pulling everything out and making sure you have a new needle. And then about 25 minutes to make it. So you can see it's not that bad. It does give you the PDF pattern so you can link it and make more. Um, so you have to go online to get that. This is what is included in this particular box pre-cut cotton fabrics, nine inch zipper, a quarter inch wide elastic, video and written instructions, 110 yard thread spool, sewing pins and sewing machine needle. What you need is a sewing machine, iron and scissors. And then on the back are just some snapshot um, directions, but for more detailed instructions, they will be online. And then the notion is not necessarily related to the project. Sometimes it just so happens it might be handy for it, but it's, uh, you just get a notion in your box. So Sampler, monthly subscription quilting box. This is by Fat Quarter Shop. She puts out different boxes. So um, there's like the Cupid box that comes out in February and um, others. So this is your monthly subscription box. It always opens up with a uh, card like this on top telling you their theme and the month. And so this is the August box and the, um, what you see here is a hint of what you're gonna see in there once we open it. So this also always has coupons on the back of this. Oh, by the way, um, everybody, all the quilt shops, for the most part, have a coupon for uh, discount shopping on their shop of some sort. I might be forgetting to mention that. Okay, so it tells you what the coupon is good for. It has the block of the month. This is something separate. I'll explain that in a minute. Um, so here, here it comes. Every month you're going to get a new one. This is block number five for the year. And I am doing this project uh, with videos. So I might as well show you. <laughs> this is my latest project or latest block. I just tucked it in here to remind me. I still needed to make this after I did the video. So I'm going to pull this out now. But this is my color scheme. I've chosen to use a different line of fabric than what they're suggesting. You can use whatever you want, but they're using Stitched Collection by Fig Tree and Company for Moda Fabrics. And they tell you exactly what, um, what colors they are using with each color placement. And I've actually been trying to stick close to that. As you can see, I've got my red here, and my, my blue there. These are whites. So I'm choosing to do it slightly different, but that's why I had this and this is more a reminder for me, but that's what I'm making is blocks of the month. All right, so this 
she has a little card and I might have put it in the bottom. Nope. She puts these in there. So this is going to be an ex explanation card. So the first thing is the fabric. And this time it's an Enchanted Emma Fat Quarter Bundle. And does it say? It also gives you the value. So it's a 1998 value. One, two, three, six fat quarters. And remember, this box is only $25. So keep this in mind as you're looking at some of these and what they're charging. <laughs> Make your own decision, but um, this is a good value and it's fun. Okay, so it gives you that. Here's your fabrics. It tells you who it's by. And then there's a little notion, and this happens to be a teeny tiny little notion in this one. This is a grapefruit flavored beeswax for hand sewing. And it smells yummy. Just don't use it as lip balm, but that's what that is. <laughs> as a value then we come over here and there's another little notion this one is a tiny little scissors has a value um she'll either get a big or one or a bunch of little ones we also get this tape measure by riley blake now this is a 12 foot tape measure in a hard case with a clip so it's a cute but heavy duty quiltster tape measure values there too flip it over we have our pattern. Now the pattern has been made with these fabrics. So these fabrics are incorporated here so you can see what you can do with it, what it's gonna look like, and it will make this pattern. There's enough of it to make the pattern. As far as the colored fabrics, the background fabric, different story. You have to supply that. Um, but it tells you what you need, walks you through the instructions, shows you placement, um, explains a little bit more back here. But this is um, for that, okay. And there's a value on that. Uh, da, 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 da. And then we have the Fig Tree and Company Block of the Month, which I addressed already. And this has a value as well. And so you're getting this for quilts. You're getting three notions. You're getting a Block of the Month. You're getting a pattern. And that's a lot for $25. Pastry Shop Quilts box of treats comes out every six weeks, so it's not a monthly box. So it it kind of is fun because it's a little bit different than all the others. But we're gonna look at just get an idea of what's inside these. It always comes packaged really pretty with tissue. Pretty much all of them do with the tissue. But she always includes a little note kind of talking about what's in there and a pattern that they have created there. And this is the box for September and the pattern that came with that. Um, I did notice in here it, a bonus thing is that it had this little diagram so you can kind of get an idea of your layout and the colors if you wanted to color that. But it has really detailed instructions including on the border. And the border on this one, if you look real close, it includes stars going out on the border. Otherwise, it would be an incomplete box, block. <laughs> anyway, so just little things like that. So now this particular one, she gives you notions, fabric, pattern. She always gives you thread and a thread saver. So this is the little guy that goes around your thread and the thread does match your project, okay? And then she'll give you, there's usually candy in there, but she gives you the fabric for the project which is the quilt and in this case she gave us two charm packs and look how pretty those are the little rainbow and they have a hint of a pattern to it and that's what's on them and this is the fabric for the border so she in this case has supplied the border fabric okay she also includes in her box a little tiny mini charm pack and it's not necessarily related to the project it's just a little bonus so you get one of these 
here's our candy for the month. It's a pastry shop box. It's got to have something sweet, right? But she said that it matches the quilt. And, you know, it does. Look at all those fun colors. <laughs> and then our notion, she had sent us this little Ulfa cutting mat. It looks like it is seven and a half by five and a half. Nice, just little mats. Sometimes you just need one. And then she's also included the Cute Cuts um, Lori Holt ruler. That's two and a half by four and a half inches. So you don't have to use them together, but they work really well. And this is a really nice one. And the pattern itself is using flying geese. And this can help with that pattern too. So Notion fabric, candy, extra charm pack, a thread and the spool saver and the pattern that they have created. That's what you can expect from a pastry shop box. the ginger quilter box. Fabric. We have a treat. She always makes these really fun because they're not just a sewing or quilting box. It's like a whole experience. <laughs> and so um, she sends you one of these. It talks about what all the different items are. And this particular box, it was a Halloween box. And she sent googly eyes for no reason other than it's fun. <laughs> and the same with these Halloween fortune cookies. It's themed, so she has included that. We'll look at the fabric here in just a second, but it comes with a pattern. And this pattern, they, she sent enough fabric, including the backing fabric, to do this quilt. Now, I don't mean backing, I mean the background. The backing you still have to come up with, but you don't usually get the background fabric and um, it's a lot of fabric. I think it says in here, mm, no, it doesn't, but it's enough to do this. So you're gonna get a pattern. Let's see, this has two Moda Charm packs, which is um, 85 inch squares, two and a half yards background, sashing and outer border. That's what that is. Two yards border and binding and four yards backing. Oh, I, I don't know what I'm looking at. Four, this is the backing. Four yards of backing. This is quite a bit of fabric, but it just seems like... And we even have this... I know that this is the um, border. She's got this for the border. But these are 5 by 10 and I didn't stack them up very pretty after I did my opening video because they're always hard to put back. But it's a full collection. And I believe this one's by Kimberbell. If not, it looks very similar to her stuff. And maybe it will even tell me right here. So I'm drawing a blank. Normally I include a notion to go along with your fabric and pattern rather than sending the notion. I've decided to include the inner border. So she sent this this month instead of an extra notion. Normally there's a gadget or a gizmo or something in there. So that's nice. Um, I don't mind doing that. Finishing kits. You can order finishing kits for her. This is new. That will give you fabric for the outer border and the backing and the binding. So outer border is this one the whole back side and the binding so that's what's not included everything else in the middle is right here and that is the ginger box
creative notions this is a monthly subscription it is in a bag and then it comes in its packaging but last year they were coming in boxes towards the end of the year because she always does a ruler of some kind that has her logo on it she has some specially made and towards the end of the year the rulers were getting big like 10 by 10 11 by 11 12 by 12 and they wouldn't fit in these so other than when she's sending something big you're going to get it in a bag like this in fact um, the last bag prior to this I'll show you this did come in a box because this ruler came in it and it obviously wouldn't fit or be protected so it did come in a long flat box instead of a bag so usually it's in a bag all right, now the nice thing about this is the bag is reusable. It's high quality quilt cotton and you can cut it up if you want or keep it and use it as a bag. There's so many, many things that come in this bag. It's, this one amazes me. All right, so <laughs> dumping it out, that didn't work very well. Okay, so here we have some treats in there. There's always at least one thing in there. And we have, there we go. This is the June box. Um, she's having problems with getting her stuff from her distributor, so she is behind, but they're all coming. She always does a contest, and then she announces the winners. They get like a jelly roll, or the equivalent to that, and then she explains the block of the month, what's in the bag. So this one has a value of $84, and this is pretty typical. It always comes with eight fat quarters, always, always, and they're wrapped up just like this, so pretty. So um, has that, it also has, in this case, a template, and this is the Rompus template, and I don't know if you noticed, but it has her little um, camper on there. All of her stuff has her little logo, and so like that um, ruler, this one, there you go, there's that ruler, it's her little camper, and that's fun. So she has her own templates, and every month you're getting a different template. Um, cotton dish towel and she gives you the price but this is um, looks like I've got two I think I'm not sure if it came with one or two I got an extra one magnetic pin wand which is the notion it also has the block of the month set what does that mean oh sorry we have all these pages down here so the set there's two block of the month patterns in this month and they're flowers do you see them larkspur and a daisy and she sent them in these plastic sheets all ready to go in your binder that she supplied earlier in the year in one of the boxes so um I would imagine, just like anything else with her, you can get a hold of her, and if she has it from a past box, including this, she will send it to you. So you just have to ask her about it. So there's also a download for the project sheets, which I've been really lazy at putting it in the box, but this is last year's sampler quilt, so I still have that in here, and then the blocks for that. I have this year, it's really cute, she's got tabs, and this right here happens to be this block. So each month has a different flower block. It's not necessarily the block of the month, but it's going to show all 12 blocks throughout the year in the book. So these are ready to go in when and wherever you want to put them. This planner, like I said, it's separate, but it was in a previous box. It has pockets and uh, it even came with these little zipper pouches with more stuff in it from her bags that I put in. This is amazing. She really puts a lot of thought into it. It's different than any other box and um, that's what's going on. So anyway, that we have those two. We also have Garden Bloom Block. Oh, sorry. That's what this is. They're both flowers. Rompus Star Pattern. Now here's the pattern using this. Now she's teamed up with uh where did it go there we go sugar and spice textiles they design all of her quilts and so you'll see that all throughout and they're showing you a table topper using that 
and the fabrics that came with it. But this is the quilt for it using the fabrics that are here, meaning there's enough of them to make this, okay? And I don't know if you can see, but it's a pretty substantial pattern. So it has good walking, <laughs> walk, walking through, let's see, it has step-by-step -step instructions to walk you through it. There we go. And then she also does videos to show you what or how to build it. And then there's other people that are doing a lot. I have not done these yet. Um, too many other projects going on, but at some point you might see those. But we also have a pattern, or sorry, a recipe, it's not even listed, and people can enter their recipes for the contest. In fact, this is one of the contest winners right here. So we've got project winner, guest winner, scrap winner, and recipe winner. So the gal who won something this month is Lola Jensen, and then there's her recipe. So I, that's just fun. Um, the fabric line is always tells you what it is, but this is my farmer. My heart belongs to my farmer by Poppy Cotton. And they've used that fabric in in their examples of stuff that they've done. Now this is like a bonus. This is another way to use the fabric that they've sent if you wanna do a table runner. So that's why it's called an idea because they're not giving you enough fabric to do all the projects, but you can pick what you wanna do. So there's enough to do the quilt. And this is just another option. That looks like a pretty good size 26 by 70, pretty good size table runner. That's for the large family. <laughs> okay, this also has the Garden Bloom quilt. Now this is the actual quilt, the layout of it, that had the, had these, see this? Now this fabric is not available yet. Blocks featured are from the Maker's Planner 2022, which is what I showed you. Each month you're going to get two block patterns and one extra block pattern will be sent for a total of 13 blocks. Creative Notions Quilt Shop will be making tutorials for each block. Finishing instructions will be sent in December and the fabric featured will be available at Creative Notions Shop in August. And everything is a little delayed so normally she likes to get them out a little sooner. So if you choose to use this she will have it for purchase. It looks like there's a, like a programming glitch, but I'm sure it's a full flower. <laughs> but, um, oh, oh, wow, they're showing you with the white background. We've got light and dark. Okay, again, ready to go in my planner. Did I cover everything from her? So there's usually a project, lots of patterns, block of the month always eight fat quarters the bag which can be add more fabric there's a notion a recipe card there's a template of some kind and there's uh, a treat of some kind this, this case it was just random candy throw it in there and uh, then it had the towel i think that's it Sewers Club box. This is a fabric only subscription. 
Again, as with all of these, there might be other options. Their website will let you know, and off the top of my head, I don't remember all of them. And, uh, but it's nice to have some options or at least go to their website and check things out. Links for everything will be below. What they always do is kind of give you this card that explains left to right what the fabrics are. So in addition to curating a really pretty um, box, and they all go together, they might not be from the same line. In fact, more likely they're not. And if you want to know what it is to get more, that's what this is. So it's, it's like a really, it's really a truly good sampler. Um, sample of different things. So there's what came in this box and left to right the um, names of them and there's 15 fat quarters. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That doesn't look right. Perhaps I took some out and I don't remember. When I opened this box and did the re review it had all the pieces in there, so go look for that. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm missing the blacks and the graphites. My bad. But they come, they come in this really cute little box with everything that you need. And I like that they tell you what it is. Pineapple Fabrics have several subscriptions available. They have a pineapple slice box, which is a pretty good sized box. I don't have one of those right now. Instead, I'm doing the Scrap Club. And so it comes in this little bag. Let's see, this has my Dottie Scrappy Bag Monthly Club. And this is $17 a month. I think I get a discount on it because I did. they do have a program where you can sign up. It gives you discounts and special offers as well as free shipping on everything. And um, so without that, it would be a little more, but that's one way that you can get your price down. But look how pretty. We have, I think there's 10. Let's see. Yeah, yep. 10 really pretty fat quarters that coordinate. And I noticed when I just did the unboxing video that these actually are not the same line. They're mostly the same line but not all, but you're gonna get really pretty fabrics. Let's try to look at them all. To see the in detail and the slower of all of the boxes and bags that I'm comparing, there will be videos. And so go to my video library and, and you will find those. Now, it seemed like there was a bonus this month. I have not gotten this box or bag. I've only had it for like three months. And in it also came this little charm square. Now I opened it up <laughs> for my video and you know, you just can't get them back in there the way they came out. But it's basically this line of fabrics. There's 42 little squares in there. And there's all kinds of things you can do with that. But I call these fat quarters, they are fat eights. I'm so sorry. They are 10 to 12 inches by 21 inches. So they're a good size. They're an oversized fat eight, if that made sense. Anything coming from pineapple fabrics, as far as fat quarters, fat eights are going to be oversized compared to what you normally get other places, because that's just their, their trademark, their thing. Okay, so this is pineapple fabrics. They, this month they also sent uh, a coupon for free shipping which is cool because you don't always get that free shipping or the ability to do that but that's all that comes in this
we're going to look at the block of the month. And the first one I'm going to open is the Mystery Quilt. This is something you can pick your own colors. Um, that they're sets, but you get to pick your colorway as well as the size that you want. And I've picked this one. And they every month they give you your pre-cut pieces as for, as well as instructions on what to make. They also give you a block of the month just for fun. And this is, I think, another month that I stuck in there because I have opened this one. But I keep all this in one place. And here we go. This is my, um, what came with my first kit. This is what my color palette is. It has instructions, so this is something you definitely want to hold on to. But these are my fabrics. And everyone can pick what they want. There's different colors. But the instructions will be the same. So that's why it says fabric A, because someone might be doing black and white and red quilt and a might be a different color but it's going to just you have to coordinate your color with the pattern because the pattern applies to everybody but you also get two choices in the pattern you get a small and a large and i've done the or picked the small and uh, it's a quilt as you go it's a mystery puzzle quilt. It has some tips and tricks in there. There are several YouTubers that can help with directions. It is also something I'm working on. I haven't done a whole lot yet, but that is my goal. But when you sign up, uh, and maybe at any time, I'm not sure if I did this when I signed up, I got what's called an, I call it an oops kit. It has extra fabrics. So even though they're sending you fabric and it's pre-cut, sometimes you goof or it's missing something that's really 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 rare but I paid extra for this it's just nice to have and the way that the block works is they send you your clues and they suggest that you hold on to it and um, when you're done label them and then at the end of all the clues coming out they will show you how to assemble it so it's called a block of the month but technically it's a project or or what would you call it? This is all I made. I didn't actually make blocks. <laughs> so I've got two of these and I have two of these and this is 1A and, and 1B. So they're labeled, they're put to the side. I will not know where they go or how they fit. I don't know what the, the quilt looks like. I just know that this is fun and my colors are yummy. <laughs> so that's what that is. They also sent me an email with some information on things I should keep in mind and use. And they do suggest that you hold on to this because they will not send another one of these out. So these two things you want to keep with your information and your oops kit. But then every month they're going to send you everything else that you need, which is right there. This is how I store it. It works for me. When I get more pieces that are bigger, I, it might not, but this is what works for me. cotton cuts. This is not fabric. This is actually a thread subscription. I decided to try something a little different. It comes like this in this little box, in, in the bag in the box, and you get, with all of their subscriptions, they always send some extra bonuses. So you always get a pencil that has a quilting fra phrase or saying on it. And it says, quilters, some strings attached. <laughs> 
And then you get a little motivational uh, postcard and then they give you a free pattern and the code to download that is on the back of the card and they give you a choice. Each month is different and you can buy all the patterns on there but you're gonna get one free one a month from their new ones that are available that month. So that's what that is. And then they also give you a block of the month and instructions. And then what this is, is a way to kind of draw your layout to get an idea of your colors and how you're doing with that. So there's some extra little things in this, but it comes with six thread. And it's, um, this is my third month getting this one. And I have a green set, I have a yellow set, and now I have the purple set. And they all have, so far have come with a white thread. So it's basically coordinating colors, including that white. Now this is a variegated, no, this one is variegated. Um, it just depends on what they send that month, but look how pretty those are. And these are different. They're all different. Um, it has the color number on top, so you can go back to them and order more. But that's just a nice way to increase your, your uh, thread. They have other subscriptions with fabric, as well as uh, the mystery quilt. Okay. So there are these and um, I'll put the price for this below because at the time I'm filling, again, I don't have that stuff handy. I apologize. The links for all of these are going to be below. I also have this one, the Ballet Batik Club. It's one of the many clubs offered through Cotton Cuts. This one is their batiks, and that's all you get are batiks, and they come packaged really nice like this. And they call it the Batik Ballet Batik Club, and they're Hoffman fabrics. This is September, but this is September of 2021. So um, this, I thought I'd pull something out of my stash to show you what they have. Kit Club is the Silver Jubilee and when it comes in addition to having your statement it has everything you need in this package including your pattern and this is what the, the quilt is it does let you know what's going on and it will send you um, a close-up as well as a, a general placement of what they have in mind for where to put the quilt piece and this is the block for this month. The finish size is 16 and a half by 16 and a half and says you're going to make one. It has a name called split rail. So this is really good for learning um, 
just learning more techniques. That's why it's called a sampler, but it is fun. The, they're calling it Silver Jubilee, but I've also seen it called Daydream Quilts, Block of the Month Club. Um, they have others, but these are the ones that I picked. And I so far have made this one and this one. And this is the one that just came. So I'm going to be getting into some that have a lot of little pieces, but I am also going to be doing videos on these. So um, besides what I have, they also have options for showing you how to make this work. The pieces are not pre-cut, but you have enough fabric to cut out, plus have some extra in case you need it. And this is just showing you how much fabric came in this month. And it's all the same line, and everyone is, does the same line. Silver Jubilee, ah, now I get it. Silver Jubilee is the line of the fabric. That makes me feel better, now I understand. So Daydream is the name of the quilt pattern. I'm getting it. <laughs> Look at all the different colors there are, and obviously the dark one there's more of they, than the others, but they these are all width of, or length of fabric, yeah, width of fabric, sorry, all width of fabric pieces. So you're only making a 16 and a half by 16 and a half block. You're going to have some seams in there, but you definitely have more fabric than you need, and they intentionally give you at least an inch, and then there's length um, just to play it safe. So what I have been doing with this is I have my little bag with my stuff in it and I'm keeping my um, patterns because it's a pattern and I'm also keeping in little bags my leftovers for the, each block. <sighs> I'm not sure why I started doing it that way. However, I have a lot of fabric left over from blocks one and two, and I might decide I want to make a, another, a smaller version, or maybe make more, or do something with the border. And I will have pieces in here to work with. And then this is, um, I had ordered some extra fabric for the, um, the, the sashing. And I'll be honest, I don't remember if it's part of the clip kit, but it comes with the first one. So it would make sense that it's part of it. But that's what this is, so I just hold on to this. So that is how this block works. I will be doing a video on that shortly, and then you will see that up. And there's also other videos up. Next one we're going to look at is the Christmas sampler quilt. I um, signed up for this late and I've opted to get this shipment every other or every two weeks. So I actually have two right now that have come. I'm a little behind on putting them together because I've been trying to gather what I needed for this video, but because it's two, every two weeks, so they came faster. But in your, your um, subscription, there's an envelope you don't need unless you owe them. I don't know how, how that would work. Anyway, it has their each $39.99 plus shipping and tax. And it's going to show you what block you're making. And each one is different. So they're different sizes. It's not like the Silver Jubilee quilt. This one's called Holly Jolly Quilt Christmas Sampler Blocks. This is Poinsettia. This is Santa Tree and Stars. And you'll have to look at the videos for this. There's lots of different ones, but they send you all the fabric that you need. So for block five, here's all the fabrics that you need. And this is the block that you're going to be making. It has your step-by-step -step instructions inside and you have the ability to go uh, online to look for videos. But again, it's only, uh, it's the colors and the right size. You still have to cut it down, but they do give you extra. And depending on how you use it, you might have extra for a bonus project. But I like that, personally, I like that it's not pre-cut because I can do more with it. But the pre-cut ones make it so simple to just sit and start sewing. <laughs> oh. And since I have both blocks here, just for fun, let's see what this one is. So this is block six. 
Oh, I, I missed this. So this is a quick overview of the quilt itself. Okay. And then it shows you where they anticipate the block to be on the quilt. And actually it makes more sense with this one to put it right where they tell you because they're not all the same size. So here's a close up of that block. And it looks like they've included a template to make his face. And then it gives you the fabric and supplies that you need. So if, if it needs stabilizer, like I had one, oh, here we go. These are pre-cut, um, die-cut pieces, and I'm pretty sure they're already on the fusible web because that's how the last one was that I had. So I just have to punch them out, but they're already on there, and then peel the back off, and heat will set it. So these are his nose, his buckle. This is his face. I guess I'll learn what this is when I get into it. This is cut out, it's kind of hard to see on the black, but these are his shoes and belt. Here is his cut out suit. Again, they're already laminated, or not laminated, but fused to the heat and bond. And you're gonna attach it to your block with an iron. And then you can do a blanket stitch around it. And there's a lot of pieces to this one. This looks like his hair and the cuff on his hat and his dress. And then we have a peace guide so in case you weren't sure what they were here it breaks it down and then you have the fabrics that are needed there's a lot of stuff to this one so these this is with the fabric these cute little polka dots and then we also have this little one with the words this looks like it's the background over here this oh you know what there's it's not just santa it's the tree and stars so that's what this is this is the the side and then santa they are getting slightly more complicated as they go. And that's good for me. <laughs> oh, it's the eye stitch pattern. I have to look at it close. So you're gonna stitch the eyes on somehow. Complete instructions and placement. Oh, here's our placement. is a package of fat quarters pieces and it comes in the subscription it comes with your statement um, a card talking about how this is their fat quarter club and then looks like they're sending some special offers too so I, I haven't actually opened this and done an Oh, I did. I did do an unboxing. I just barely did it. Um, but this is what came in. So it's nice and flat and small. And all you're getting really are the fat quarters. This one is $23.99 a month plus shipping and sales tax. Um, so you're roughly $30 for this. And you get one, two, three, four, five, six quilt shop quality fat quarters that coordinate with each other. Annie's Fat Quarter Club does give you a free pattern each month to download. And it, once you log into your account, you can get to that.
this one right here, I took the tag off because I, I, I just didn't think. But this is a fat quarter bundle. And what's interesting is they're all like fruit, food, kitchen themed. I don't know if you can see that. Very cute. Anyway, um, this came from Quilt. Oh, um, <laughs> oh my gosh. Quilt Addicts Anonymous. That's funny. With Stephanie. And so this is where you're paying just to get the new release of Fat Quarters. And that's all that you get. So I won't open that, but you can see that you're getting eight, nine, really, at least in this pack, really pretty quality, high quality cotton fabrics in a new line that would have been just released.